This is a day Dean Jones and Craig Rial have been talking about for months. The revolving frame, the top white part, is being lowered down onto the tub of the drag line being built at the Freedom Mine. Once we come down on that, it'll never leave that again, at least for 20 years. So this is a big day. Dean Jones works for the Coteau Properties Freedom Mine. Craig Rial works for CCC Group, the contractor on this job. Everybody's excited. I mean, you know, for, for some, some people it's the first time. Uh, matter of fact, <clears throat> I've been in with the drag line stuff for a long time, but this is actually my first time lowering one. Uh, I've had several projects of mine, but uh, I've never been able to be there at the right time. This is a closer look at the tub. The tub is what the revolving frame sits and rotates on once the drag line is working. This morning we, we made sure all the dirt was out from under the rollers and the, and the rails uh, because that, uh, once we come down there's not a lot of access to that and you can't get them really clean. And everything has to be spotless before we grease it and, and go to work. The revolving frame must be lowered a total of 40 inches. The job will take at least eight hours. The work is done eight inches at a time. It's just a safety factor, plus uh, the hydraulic rams themselves, most hydraulic rams don't have a long stroke to them. So these, these uh, jacks have a 12 inch stroke, we're going to only use eight inches of it. First, the revolving frame is lifted less than an inch up. The supports that have been holding the frame in place are removed. Then, a pre-measured eight inch section is cut. Some of the sections need a little extra incentive to tumble out. Once the first sections are out, the frame is slowly lowered. This first time is the most critical. The frame must be exactly in line with the pin on the tub. Yeah, left to right, front to back, we're looking at about, a, about an eighth of an inch. We've got clearance on the bushing, so that's all we can do is land that three and a half uh, million pounds within an eighth of an inch. Once the frame is sitting eight inches lower than before, the process starts up again. It's lifted slightly, sections are cut, and the frame is lowered another eight inches. This video shows three minutes of work in three seconds. There are fewer than 20 people on site. Most days, there are about 60. We want to focus just on this part of it. If, you know, if you have a lot of other people around, that's more people you got to worry about and everything else. Here we have teams that have been assigned. We reviewed the whole project and everything. So everybody has a, a station they work in. Tomorrow everybody comes back in and we go to back to work. The milestone started at about 10.30 a.m. and was finished by 6 p.m. This is some of the most boring things we can do and we want it that way. <laughs> For Dakota Coal Company, I'm Tracy Battenhausen.